Sam Young Donut starting off the day. Okay, so Young Donut's going game watch and Sam starting Luigi this time. Uh, he won Falcon uh, last week, but uh, had mixed success with it. Uh, Luigi, I've seen a lot more of from him. And Young Donut actually mains Falcon in Melee. But he's picking up Game & Watch. He was the person just on commentary for the money matches. Here to commentate. Alright, we got $10 winner, Grunk, join us, joining us. Oh yeah, I tried my, my darndest. Yeah, well, uh, it certainly cho showed some improvement on the Pit Ditto since the other time. Is that your second time doing the Pit Ditto with him, or have you done yeah, it before? that was the second time. Okay. I don't know if it's like a recurring thing between you two. No, I don't know. I don't even know why it's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, who suggested it first? Uh, I, I did. You did. Yeah, because he said he was going to go pit all day one bracket, and then I said I was going to pit ditto him, and then we didn't end up playing. Oh. Because <laughs> he lost him build or something. I don't know. Now you guys money match and pit dittos. Mm. <laughs> Probably won't change. Sure. Well, I wouldn't it, expect so. it to. This is a weird matchup. Uh, yeah. Uh, Luigi's got plenty of quick moves, and he's going to be floaty and throw them out over and over. Yeah, I don't like, think. Well, one of, one of the things that Luigi's going to do a lot is he's going to go up with one move and then come back down with another. Uh, and Game & Watch can actually do kind of similar things. Um, he has a bunch of multi-hit moves. He has a bunch of moves that have landing hitboxes. He has a little bit of priority with uh, disjointedness. But he's pretty light. I feel like he should be using um, down tilt more. Yeah, down tilt's really good. Like when he tries to win the yeah, uh, that's quite a strategy, actually. Uh, some Luigi's really dislike that about the Marth matchup. Uh, they use so much down tilt. Down tilt yeah. yeah, especially melee. Yeah, that seems like a tough matchup. You get bodied on stage, too. <laughs> well, in some ways, that's Luigi. Yeah. But you just kind of accept it and you're, uh, you move on. Uh, that, the hitbox does stay out for a while. Uh, the game watch is relatively similar to Smash 4, if you think about it. Like, the moves are pretty much the same, except in air. And, uh, one of the differences was, oh, messed up the bucket. Um, the side B, you can actually tell, uh, what's gonna come after, uh, to some extent. Like, you see how it has dots on top of it? Uh, it tells you whether the next one's gonna be even or odd. Not only that, you can't get the same number, uh, for three times uh, after you use it, yeah. so huh. or for the next two like times. Three times in a row. No, you can't. Let's say you get a one. You can't get a one for the next two side Bs. Oh, okay. So if you get a one and then a three and then a five, and you know the next one's gonna be odd, then you have a fifty percent chance of getting a nine. <laughs> Between or something like that. Nine. However it works. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. Know. Yeah. I don't remember it all. Oh, uh, I, I may have mis-explained it, but it's something along those lines. Well, if you got if you got an odd, what do you always get an odd then? Um, or, or the dots change. The, the dots change. Oh, okay. Like it is still random. Oh, okay. I don't think there are any guaranteed nines. Yeah, that would be a little broken. Sometimes we have Nano in the chat to explain random things like that, but not right now. And if you watch this on YouTube, feel free to comment. Make those gifty cats. Make some ton of gifty cats. Yeah. Oh, See, I'm knocking Young Donut off stage, trying to get the last stock. Oh, that did a lot of shield damage, actually. Young Donut kind of checks his shield for a little bit. Does, does Donut actually play PM? Um, well, he plays some PM, and he's getting more into playing Game & Watch. This this would be an upset. I would expect Sam to do pretty well. Uh, 
Falcon. Ooh, out comes Falcon. Sam, uh, going Young Donuts main in melee. <laughs> so, uh, it could be even more in Young Donuts' favor, unless uh, he just, just really helps the punish game for Luigi. Uh, it helps Sam's mentality in that. Yeah, that's probably what it's more about, is mentality. Maybe he wasn't feeling Luigi. Because I, I don't really see this being a, a great matchup. I don't know, you're Falcon. How do you feel about it? Uh, the matchup with Game Watch? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you got a Nubble Spike immediately. And Game Watch still barely made it back. Uh, they both should destroy each other when they get any hits. Uh, but Game & Watch is, uh, disjointedness on his moves. And that he has some quick attacks and it's like... The, the neutral B projectile that I don't really understand yet. Uh, like there are clearly tools for a game and watch to handle Falcon. Yeah. Um, and I feel like like Falcon isn't like he's overrated as far as the character is concerned in melee and PM. Um, like people just need to understand how his hitboxes work because like Falcon has very few things that really threaten on a like unreactable level, and he needs a certain amount of space to handle a lot of that. Like, sure, he can run really fast, uh, but if, if you're just losing to a dash dance only kind of game, then you're not you're not outplaying them. <laughs> like, you're you're playing into their game. Yeah. Um, there are clear strategies that beat reaction only. Um. But it is pretty even so far. <laughs> really late on that grab. Ooh, that bear can lead into something even better than that. <laughs> um, you probably could have fell through and uh, done a nair, yeah. <laughs> uh, he aimed for the the sausage. I don't know what that one was. Chicken thigh. It looked more like an eggplant. Why is Game Watch frying those? Sauteing. Eggplant Parmesan, some sausage. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't attack out, but he can't grab the edge from it. Oh, uh, that was a tough situation. He was gonna get hit. Ooh, grab right between the dash attack and the up uh, and the down down tilt coming out. That cross up up air. That was nice. Ooh, those are some of the combos that Game Watch can do on just about everybody in the game, actually. Uh, game Watch has a solid punish game all around. Um, like he he doesn't have any huge holes when it comes to different sizes or weights or ball speeds it seems. Yeah. So uh, that's one of the nice things about characters like him and uh, like Falcon can tech chase the the fast ballers. So like he still has some punish game on those. No, yeah, I was when I played. Nano with my Squirtle, like I felt like I shouldn't have been getting comboed, but that's what I was getting comboed with, but it was. Yeah, he's very practiced at a lot of that stuff. Well, oh, like, down tilted there. Just like my character way, I didn't think like it should have worked some of the stuff. Yeah, uh, but when you play like heavier or fastballer characters, like I do all the time, you're just like, oh, my character just takes it. Yeah. Oh, and King Watch coming down, uh, just the way Falcon wants. He could have thrown out either a couple different hitboxes or jumped at a different time to get out of there, but uh, that was the opening that Sam needed. Yeah. Could have been air dodged, right? Yeah. Uh, like, if you air dodge that last hit, Falcon's just off stage yeah. and he's dead. Like, you just edge guard him. Some of that stuff isn't actually a combo. Uh, unfortunate, but that would be actually broken for Falcon. Um, lots of DI opportunity. Yeah, that's something I gotta learn. Yeah, every new matchup in PM, uh, you gotta learn how to DI out of their combos because they practice their combos. They they know their their own character, um, way better than you can learn in one best out of three. Yeah. Uh, at least in a best of five, you get a little bit more time, but uh, you probably won't learn how to DI everything at that point. You just gotta learn their neutrals. Yeah. Well, if you can stay safe in the neutral, you don't have to worry about being punished. <laughs> Young Donut starts off with uh, <laughs> two little bell rings. One as the taunt cancel and the other as the, the nine. And Risky Fair. Uh, 
There's a down tilt after fair. Terra. Um, ooh, down air stays out long enough. And Falcon actually super easy to tech chase because he just kind of stays in place for a while. Yeah. And the Terra stayed in place, uh, was stayed active for so long that Falcon rolled into it. Uh, Nair, no. Uh, oh, could have covered that double jump knee. That was a really dangerous knee. Uh, but he got punished for it either way. Um, he just wants knee after that. That's the kind of stuff that Sam's gonna go for. Uh, but when he misses, he's gonna get edge guarded. Um, Nair from full range. Uh, works out for him. Uh, oh. <laughs> was that a missed tech? Or was it just perfect distance from the floor where he couldn't tech? Look at all. Uh, I mean, there weren't really combos in there. Game Watch wasn't in hit stun for much of that. Yeah, like he can jump there. Sam's certainly stretching for a lot of his Falcon combos. Uh, and oh, looks like oh, okay. Uh, Young Donut still at his jump. Forward smash too slow. Uh, down throw leads into combos way better than up throw. Is it the same in melee too? Uh, in general, yeah, yeah. but uh, not always. And it's really a weight dependent thing. And a fastball speed. Uh, or not fastball, but just general fall speed. Young Donut throwing out, or just kind of playing too unsafely around Falcon. Like, not respecting the area that Falcon wants to attack and can attack. Uh, oh, and that's enough. Like, the, the kind of stuff that I would rather see is you have to space around Falcon. Um, like, he. Yeah, he's uh, just kind of jumping into the space that Falcon is able to cover first. Uh, like, Young Donut's already at like a small disadvantage or something, he just got hit, and then he just kind of ends up where Falcon was throwing out a move anyway. Like, lots of not combos actually just work.